that my daughter is actually a red-nosed pit bull, yes. um, Isabu. This is Dr. Courtney Campbell. He's new to our Hi. show. He's yes. a vet. And I think that around the holidays, people are very mindful, if they have small children in the house, of, of hazards for kids. Yes. But we are not as mindful as hazards to our pets. Yeah, it, it's it's a real issue. And one thing I know about you is you love the holiday season. I do. You love plants and you love pets. I so do. this is like the trifecta we have going on <laughs> yeah. here. And I see all of these excellent examples of things that can be hazardous. Right. I see first up to bat, though, plant hazards. Most pet parents are familiar with poinsettias. They say, up. Uh, are those toxic? They definitely are, but remember when it comes to toxins, size matters. So for all of the smaller or even bigger pets, how much they get into is key. And here's the good news about poinsettia. It's not as toxic as we once thought it was. Oh. So you still may see some vomiting and diarrhea, still need to call your vet, but the good news is you don't need to panic. But I do see here, and I think we're all familiar with mistletoe. mistletoe. Yep, we know the power it has when you kind of hang it above somebody's head. You right, know what right, I mean? Right. Yeah, absolutely. Smoochy, smoochy. Smoochy, smoochy. But it has the power to make pets sick. You know? I it, did not know that. My mom's yeah. cats also, they eat a lot of plants. They love, you know, the smell of rose petals and things. Of course, instance. of course. So this is uh, really something that you should keep out of reach, maybe, of the cats and the dogs. And 100 percent. Poinsettia, absolutely. Vomiting and diarrhea. Same, M mistletoe, with mistletoe, vomiting diarrhea. It can actually sometimes actually depress heart rates, too. So you got to be careful. Oh, my that. God. But here's the one that always catches my eye. When I see holly, I just think of the holiday season, right? It's the most common ornamental plant we have. Right. Right? And what it has in it is something called a saponin, which is uh, a substance in plants that's like soap. And if you have soap in inside the intestine, that, that substance inside the plant, it can make dogs vomit oh. and cats vomit. So all three of these, you just have to think, definitely vomiting and diarrhea, you got to be careful. You know what's a good alternative? Uh, yeah, go down to the Joann's Fabric or go. Michael's Crafts and buy fake of all of this. Silk or plastic. Yeah, silk or plastic. Yep. You get all the decoration that's without right. the danger. That's right. That's right. Unless you want to be cleaning up you know what for days. Yeah, exactly. You go plastic or go home. Go home. Well, You're you? awesome. Yeah, We're going to no, have Dr. You. Courtney thank back you. as often as he can get the day off from the vet clinic. <laughs>